Hello, it's Jack 16 from My Lego C, and today we're looking at my first ever Lego set. I had this a good 15 years ago, probably more than that. And where do we begin? Well, for my first ever set, it was pretty cool, and I did like the police in that years ago. Not too much first on it now, but um, no, Lego do a good job of uh, mega police stuff. That's probably one of their biggest sellers, is all the police and that. I don't know the set number, but it will be on the description, like always. So, what do you get? Well, you get loads of minifigs. Um, there's even one in the cell. So, let's see. we got one, two, three. He drives a car, if I remember rightly. He's maybe in this one. So, three, four. I think you get five altogether. I may have added a few more. I think it's five. There's also one in that at a computer desk. So we'll say about five. I'm not 100% sure. So uh, this has actually been packed up in a different box all these years. It last came out about 2003. So that's like 10 years ago. So um, all the bits are here. But there has been a few bits like what was put in the box. I didn't know when, where. So I just added them. Uh, like there's this, this bike now. I don't think this actually come with a set, so we'll keep him out. But I know the car did. He come with this set, and he's missing a light. Of course, he would be. I've got loads left over though, so not a problem. This bike come with it. Missing a. Oh no, yeah, that's meant to be that. I thought I wasn't there, but no. So, so let's have a look at. That. Wow. It's a, it represents like a really big police building. Um, got opening doors down here, and then obviously you got the first floor, the second floor, so ground first, second, and then you got this bridge, which I always like this feature, and then you got another office, and a radar dish on the top of it. Underneath this office, you got a little like, place to park the vehicles, like a police bike and a car. And there's a desk in there as well, a red desk. These flowers as well, another nice feature. And like I said, there's opening doors. Uh, probably can't open them, no. And then the main feature really was this jail cell. Because I always remember the picture, I had the jail cell all destroyed and the prisoners running away. And you got a woman chasing him and that. So I'm guessing she's the guard. Um... But the minifigs are all, this is where they meant to be, apart from him, he's meant to be in the car and he's meant to be up there. But another thing with these, that I don't think I liked at the time, but now I see why. Whoops. It's like the, what do you call it, Dar's house style. And you can get into the building, to the back. It's actually quite good, because you just, instead of taking the entire roof off, you get to your minifigs and put them in. So that's nice. And same with the main building. Uh, you got a man on his computer, a little coffee area, two cups. That's the two only cups I own. I need to get loads more, but I guess with all the Lego City vehicles, I'll get one. And yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. There's a man down here. Um, I guess that's the checkout desk, actually. And like I said, doors open, as you can see that, just opened them. So yeah, nice kit. Uh, I'm not sure how much it would have cost. I would say around £40. Uh, Lego was an that dear those years ago. You also get this helicopter, I was meant to say. Um, no pilot at the moment. I don't know which one flew, uh, flew the helicopter. Nice little helipad on top though. When I actually built it back up, I put the helipad on here. But it um, didn't look right. Then I remember it went on here. Uh, the early part's actually out of place. There we go. So yeah, that is my first ever Lego kit. Like I said, I'll find out the set number. Um, I've seen one, I think, on eBay in the last few weeks. But that's all. So I don't know if they're collectible or not. Like I said, this one is 100% complete and a few bits added. So... Yeah, it's a very nice kit. 
I also got a fire station one which we'll be looking at next. And that'll be it for the reviews today. So Marco 10. Ooh. I give it about a 7.5. Mainly because I never like the back on there where you can put your mini figs, but I don't know. 7.5. It's just it's just one of those kits, I suppose. It's got loads of play value. That's the main thing, I suppose. So, thanks for watching, and Fire Station next.